Hello guys, welcome back to Arcage. One thing I didn't do on the stage 3 beta that I got into was create a Furin. I created all the other races, uh, did videos for them, but I didn't create one of these, so I thought during the stage 4 that we're in now, I would create a Furin. So I'll accept that. And let's see what we can do with the character select, uh, character creation screen. Okay, okay. Ooh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, quite like that. That's pretty cool, isn't it? I'll tell you what we will do though, uh, if we can. Yeah, select race of the old male, the furin. I'll take it they are, are they? Surely not. Let's have a female. Except. Ooh, those are big baby blues, aren't they? Let's look at these presets. Anything there? That's quite nice. It's too human. Too human, though, for this race. Struck on the hairstyle though. No, no, no. Big ears, I like them. Oh, yes, yes. Uh, eyes, can we change the color? Oh yes, I like that. Yeah. How's that then? That looks alright, doesn't it? Yeah, awesome and I. Uh, da, 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 da. Skill set. No, then. Should it be a healer type? I've not done one of those yet, I don't think, have I? Um, yes. So you will take that with it being a different server. Not sure if all, if any of these uh, characters survive after after the beta. I'm not sure. So we find out. <laughs> Very dapper. Yes. <laughs> okay. An ancient bard's tale once dubbed the Firin, the children of the Gale. Firin kits learn to run before they can walk, a must for a race as restless as the wind. Usually settlers record their lives or build towers in the ground, but not the Firin. They see no need for hearth or home, and require little more than dew to moisten their throats and meat to fill their bellies. Centuries ago, when war tore Aurora, the hero Taiyang led the Firin onslaught. It's said that when he fell, slain by his best friend, the plains burst into flame in protest. When the Firin fled Aurora, 
they left their grief behind. The wind of their new range brushed their tears away. Other settlers were puzzled by the cat people's feral ways, especially the wealthy Harani. Their suspicions jinxed peace from the start. No Harani was ever praised for his genial nature, and the clash with the Firin came swiftly. Though the Children of the Gale claimed more victories, their opponent was an entire empire. Worrying with advanced technology and trained fighters. To stand against such a well-oiled machine, the Firin had to build their own empire. They called it Temi, and for the Harani, victory became even rarer. Fighting their swift, fierce opponents was like fighting a storm. The Harani backed off. Meanwhile, the Firin grew accustomed to their homestead and began assimilating Harani ways. The Harani bided their time, waiting for the Firin to forget how to fight like the wind. This time, when the Harani struck, their domination was absolute. The Temi Empire shattered like ice, sending shards of Firin back to the wilds. But the wind does not stay quiet forever. Nomads again, the Firin found strength in the plains. They left their grief in the Temi ruins and let the wind brush away their tears. Their power and might rose like a thunderhead. Hundreds of years passed. Seers announced the birth of a new great Mara. He was to lead the Firin back to the plains of their ancestors, on Auroria. Just as Taiyang had prophesied. The key will be to keep the history of Temi from repeating itself. To reclaim the plains, not by building an empire, but by embracing the wild nature of the wind. By embracing the spirit of Taiyang that still lives in you all. Okay, so there's the backstory of the Karani. Let's see what their starting zone's got to offer. The WAS key. Press F or right click to activate quests. Windstone. Any object with a blue exclamation mark. Okay, a speed buff. Corpses that sparkle can be looted for items and coins. F what skills we got then? While G lets you pick and choose. I don't think we need that, do we? Or do we? No, let's leave it just in case. Try and kill you something. What if we go? To be most effective in battle, try to vary the skills you use. Your shortcut keys will make it easier to alternate between them. Corpses that sparkle can be looted for items and coins. F picks up all items, while G lets you pick and choose.
Hello, Annie. Touch a windstone. Well, we've done that already, but we'll do it again, eh? Report to Kanga. with green markers. Targets with foreign. Uh, cool, Plateau Fox. Three of them. No, oh, level two. Okay, three, three. Forlorn Snorm Lane Cub. Uh huh. Well, he's done something playing the uh, the loot. So a look. <laughs> oh dear. Hello. I take it that's my mount. Raise your own one day, not today then, okay. Earn a skill point, open skills. To open the skills window. Hmm. You'll find it easier to alternate between... Spend skill points to learn new skills. Click the skill icon in the menu bar, or press K to open the skills window. Alright. What does it do? Cures one debuff and increases received healing for three minutes. Inflict snare. Alright, so it's a snare on the on enemies. Okay, alright. Let's go and see what that does then, see if it works.
I'm going in the right direction here, yes I am. Report to Mahra Abaran. And report to Bash. the first one. Bring Mandragora roots. Isn't it? Yes. Click remember to memorize your current location. Okay, we've done that. Oh, he looks a bit mean, doesn't he? Okay, that's done. That was rather easy. As the sun clawed its way above the horizon, it brought with it the dawn of your Bajant trials. This coming-of-age ceremony had been practiced by the Firin since ancient times. The elements wind, water, fire, and earth were the land's true rulers, reigning over life and death. Passing the Bajan trials meant receiving each element's blessing as a mature adult warrior. Okay, what's your problem with that? To do that, we need to get some uh, Mandragora boots. Quest log icon in the lower right, or press L to view quest details. Press Numlock to automatically run forward without holding. Ding. 
Yes, level four. Ooh, look at us go. Oh, hang on, take that first. Fern break. Might as well do that before we go back, eh? Well, 14, uh, 34 labour points, so let's have a go at that. You need labour points. Yes, 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 I know, we need labour points. Five of five, okay, let's head back. Lucius. All right, so when it looks like we need to go to the Saint Cliffs. These always give a quest, don't they? Remember rightly? Except... Oh no! Kill Plateau Earth Elementals. Really? Alright guys, well maybe we'll do that next time, eh? Don't forget, if you like the videos, please leave me a like and subscribe, it's very, very helpful. Also leave any comments in the comments below. Thanks very much guys. This is all Grace signing off.